Hi guys, Top Pops here, and today we are going into Target right now because today was Target Con. Well, it was actually this morning, um, and I did order some stuff online just to make sure I got it, but I do want to show you guys what's here because there should be a couple things, I hope, here that I didn't pick up online. So, fingers crossed I've got some. So, let's go to the back and let's get started. Alright guys, so here's what they've got. Okay, this is great. So, for some of the things here, um, they do have some of the stuff. Oh, this is awesome. Okay, cool. So they have the Kool-Aid Man. This is one that I ordered online. So I ordered Kool-Aid Man online. And I also ordered a Target Con t-shirt. But I think I'm going to grab another one. Just because I want to wear it for today's video. It makes sense. Is there anything back here? No, it doesn't look like it. But let's go through these. Show off all the different stuff that's here. Because there's a lot of them. So here's the thing. I want the Garfield Pop. They only have it in a small. So I might grab this anyways. Just because. Um, it's $24, I don't know. But I do want to grab this Funko Verse here today for sure. It's the Kool-Aid Man one. Um, I don't know exactly, it's only 14 bucks. So I think we'll grab this one for sure for my Ad Icon collection. Um, and then we also have this one here. This one was exclusive to right now as well. It, it was either exclusive or it's just coming out right now. I'm not gonna grab this. It's pretty big though. It's a big Funko Verse one. So this one's just an expansion pack. This one here comes with all four of them. So that's really neat. And we also have the Pushing with Pizza down here as well. That's cool. And it looks like they got in some of the Michael Jordans today. Um, but if we go a little bit higher, here guys we do have this right here so this is a pushing with cupcake and then we also have this one here no do you do you know apex legends pathfinder yeah i know it is I haven't, that in a long time. I haven't really heard of this one i mean i do have one of the apex ones i have um i don't even know if she's on the back here oh yeah lifeline i have lifeline so that's cool um, I don't know if I'm going to pick that one up today, but I did see this one was going quick. So the only thing that they're missing that I really wanted was this one right here. The Chester Cheetah Pop Tea. I did miss that one online, so that's too bad. Oh, then they also have this one here from Tombstone. They have Doc Holiday, so that's cool. But anyways, guys, let's grab a Target Con t-shirt, Garfield, and then the Kool-Aid Funkovers. Hold on, guys. I almost missed it. They also have the thing here from Fantastic Four. Now, this is one. I don't know if I'm going to grab it. It's really cool. I do like it a lot. Ah, oh, that's a tough one. I might grab this one, actually. So they have D.O., Olaf, Ezra, and the other stuff. But I do want to get the thing here, maybe. Because this one's new for today. Um, I'll think about it. I'll let you guys know. Also, guys, so here's the back section here with all the other stuff. It looks like it's a lot more of just the same ones. I came back here to see if they might have the Chester, but it doesn't look like they do. It's a glow in the dark one in a t-shirt. I really wanted to get that one, um, but I missed it on the website. I missed it now in person. That's fine. I'll order it eventually. We'll find it because it's an ad icon. I want to get all of them. Um, but I did notice down here that they do have more pushing with Cupcake, and they've got Kool-Aid Man and the thing, more of them over here. So it's nice that they have a couple more. Um, I don't really have to worry about them. Um, but yeah, guys, there it is. Not too much else going on here. So let's grab these guys and let's go back to the studio and show them off closer up. Oh, also, I didn't even mention it, guys. They have the new Target Con logo here, which is really cool. So they actually put it on, that's what's on the t shirt there, which looks really great. Um, and then they also have it up there. Like people used to just call it Target Con for the first two, and now um, Funko and Target have actually made Target Con merchandise, which I think is great. So there it is on this as well. I think it'd be so cool to get one of these shelves and put like all your Target exclusives on here. Um, I'm guessing I'm not gonna be able to get this one unless I buy all of them, so I'm not doing that. Uh, but they do have some really great ones here, and I'm super excited that we got those ones. But uh, yeah, guys, let's keep going. All right, guys, so we are back from Target Con now, and that was really exciting. So I got a couple things today. I already got my shirt on. I'm super excited about this one. So this is the Funko Target Con 2020 shirt. Here's the box for it, too, if you guys want to see that close up. So it's a really nice shirt. I'm a big fan of this. It's supposed to be like the superhero shirt, almost like Superman opening up his collared shirt to then have this under it. I don't know. It's really neat. This is a limited edition one, so I wonder if they're going to sell out of this one. They're not going to be getting any more in. I'm not exactly sure. Um, but this is supposed to look like a comic book there, which looks really great. So there's the box. Um, they are a large, so I got an XL, and it fits pretty nice. I'm a size, I'm a, I'm 6'3", I believe it is, like 6'2", 6'3", um, and it fits pretty well, so it's not bad, um, if you guys are wondering about sizing and stuff like that. I don't know, it's usually like, if you have one Funko t-shirt, they're all pretty much the same size, um, and I've been getting XLs pretty much for the length here, but anyways, so there's the shirt right there, that's really awesome. Now, I also want to mention, before we get into this stuff here, I did order some stuff online just because I knew I was going to be going later in the day, so I've got the list here of different stuff that came out. We have the 10-inch Pushing with pizza. We have the 10 inch Kool Aid Man, 10 inch The Thing, Pushing with Cupcake, uh, Tombstone's Doc Holiday with Cup. Then we have The Mandalorian with Gauntlet, um, Apex Legends Pathfinder Sweet 16, Flocked Garfield Pop and T Set. Um, we have The Glow in the Dark, Chester 
Chester Cheetah Pop and Tea Set, the Target Con 2020 Limited Edition Tea, and then the Kool-Aid Man Expansion Funkoverse game, and then the Jurassic Park Funkoverse game. So all of that right there is what was exclusive today at Target Con. So the stuff that I did order online, I ordered a Target Con shirt because I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to get it. I ordered um, the Mandalorian, which sold out in my store and now online, so it's cool that I got that one. And then I also ordered the 10-inch Kool-Aid Man. Um, so those ones will be coming in soon. We'll do an unboxing when they do come in. I was just afraid I wasn't going to be able to get those ones, so I didn't buy them, or you know, I didn't wait till to buy them in the store, just in case. Um, if you guys are wondering what's sold out online right now, it's the Mandalorian, um, Chester Cheetah with t-shirt, and then this shirt right here. So some of the stuff seems to be going pretty quick, but I'm super excited about all A lot of it's been pretty cool. Um, so let's get into the stuff that I got today, and let's start with this right here. So this is the Kool-Aid Man Funkoverse. Um, I don't know if I'm going to open this. I'm a pretty big fan of this. I mean, I can put it right back in. It's just, it's all taped up. But there it is right there, guys. Um, actually, let me go get the scissors. I'll go open it up real quick. All right, guys, I grabbed the scissors, and then I also grabbed the normal Kool-Aid Man to compare sizes here. I think these are kind of like the size of a mini figure, like one of those like ones they used to do um, where they were like almost like two inches tall. So let's cut into this here. I just wanted to grab scissors because I want to make sure this stayed nice. I wasn't going to open it up. And um, if you guys are wondering, this Funko verse here is only $15. So it's not that expensive, which is great because sometimes the bigger ones are like $40, I think 30 bucks. So those ones can be kind of hefty, but it's a board game, right? So there's a lot more than just the figures. It's also the, uh, you know, you can play with it and stuff like that. So let's open this guy up, see what he's like. I'm really excited to see what it is because there's also the pieces in here too that make it like the expansion pack. Now this one, you'd probably have to buy one of the bigger um, boxes to go with this one as well, but this is still so cool. So here is the Kool-Aid man. I mean, this is the main thing because there's like the little, um, little gems inside of here that you can use the stand for the Kool-Aid man as well as these pieces here. Um, and I actually don't know what they do with it. I believe also on the inside here, if you take this out, there should be, yeah, the card inside of here as well. So there is the Funkoverse um, booklet and then card to go with that right there. So you can use this for the Funkoverse game. I think it, it'd be really fun to play as the Kool-Aid man, uh, but also here's the figure right here. So let me pop him out. Okay, so here is the Kool-Aid Man figure, and he does have the stand, like I said, but he does stand all right without it, um, but that is so cool. I'm such a big fan of this one, especially with the ad icons. I don't normally get um, the Funkoverse games. I have the DC one, but I don't have any of the other ones yet, so this is pretty cool, though. So let me pop this guy out of the box. I also think he's in a different pose. He is. He's got a different pose than this one here, so... This one here, he's got his hands open, and you guys can see here, so this one's like about three inches tall, and then this one's maybe two, maybe two and a half, I'm not exactly sure. So he's not that much smaller, but still, they're both really cool. I um, mean, it'll be cool to have the last size, which will be the 10 inch one way up here, so we'll have the three of them going down like that. This is all really cool. Um, so yeah, the difference is he's got his hands open, this one's he's got his fists closed, kind of like like that. Um, I don't know, it kind of looks like he's more ready to fight like in Funkoverse and stuff like that, but overall, really great figure, and for it only being $15 in like the expansion to the game, um, it is pretty exciting. All right, so last but not least, we picked up the Garfield t-shirt. Now, the only reason I got this one was because I wanted the pop. Um, and the box is really nice as well. So this is supposed to look like a lasagna box. Um, this here is $24.99 if you were to buy these. And the problem is it's a small t-shirt. Um, so there it is right there, guys, if you want to check that out. It is a small shirt. I'm an XL, like I said. Um, so it's kind of annoying that I did get a small one. But we've been talking about this for a long time. We just never really got the time to do it. Um, my mom knows how to make t-shirts into pillows, kind of. So I wanted to try that out with some of the smaller shirts that wouldn't fit me. Um, because I like to have the shirts. It's just sometimes like, when it comes to stuff like this, you want the figure more than you want the shirt. So to get flocked Garfield, I kind of had to sacrifice not being able to wear the shirt. It's a really nice shirt. I'll show it to you guys still here. Um, I, I just can't wear it. And it says on the side here, guys, lasagna, um, nature's most perfect food. And then on this side, it says, I haven't had a lasagna I didn't like. So it's cool that they put the Garfield art on the sides there as well. And then on the front, it's got the Garfield right there as well. So now I think I have every single Garfield Funko Pop. I can show you guys those too in a second. Um, but let's start with the t-shirt here, I guess. All right, so for the shirt, it's actually really nice. I like the shirt. I wish I, got, I, wish I got a large, at least a large. I can fit into a large. But here is the t-shirt right here, guys. <laughs> There's no way 
I'm fitting into this. But it's a really nice shirt. I like it a lot. It says Garfield's Lasagna, and he's kind of sad on there. It's cool because it's not a pop tee as well. Um, because, you know, I have so many pop t-shirts. I've been trying to get some Funko ones that weren't so much pop tees, like this one and this Garfield one right here. It's just too bad I can't wear it because it's so small. But I do like the, uh, the sleeves and stuff there, and then the head, the neck hole, I guess you could say, right there. That's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, anyways, other than that, we also have the pop here as well, which is this one. So here it is right here, the Flocked Garfield. This is a cool one. So there was only one left, so I'm really just glad that I could get anything from this stuff because, I, I mean, I went way later in the day than I, I, I think I should have, but uh, that was the only time I could go. So there's the Flocked Garfield right there, which looks really great. Now let me grab the other ones and I'll show you the rest of the set. Okay, so there are three other ones in this set, and these ones are all part of the Pop Comics line. So there is this normal Garfield here, which I think looks really great. Um, this is the same one as this right here, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, so this one's just the flocked version of this one here. So both really cool pops. Then we've got OD, which is another great one. I like that one too. And then last but not least, we have the I Hate Mondays Garfield right there. And I just noticed something. I don't know if it's with all of them. I should check that. Yeah, it is. Okay, that's weird. Let me show it on this one here. So guys, on the inside flap there, it actually has like little paw prints walking across. And I, I'm pretty sure those would be Garfield's um, paw prints right there, but that is really cool. I like when Funko does these small um, little hidden things in their boxes. I wonder if there's anything on the bottom, because sometimes they hide it on both. Nope, just the top there. But anyway, still really cool. So anyways, guys, that's all for today. Um, like I mentioned, we will be um, showing off the other stuff when they come in. I just don't have them as of yet, because I want to make sure I got them. So like I said, I ordered the Mandalorian, I ordered the Kool-Aid Man, and then I ordered another Target Con shirt. I tried to order the Chester Cheetah, but it sold out too quick. So, too bad, but I'll find it eventually. I mean, it's not too bad. It's not one of those ones that's like, probably gonna get super expensive. I'm guessing maybe $30 to $40. I don't know what it's at right now, I'd have to check on it. But um, I'm sure we'll be able to get it eventually. Because it's one of those ad icon ones that I really want to get for the set, because I don't want to skip past that one and then forget about it. And then have to wait like, you know, so long to try and spend like $100, whatever. I don't know. It'll probably get expensive if I wait is what I'm saying. So anyways, that's going to do it for today. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you want to see more from me in the future, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, do all that. But this has been an episode of Top Pops, Popsters. Thanks for watching. See you guys tomorrow.